do next is take the Beauty Counter Concealer Pen in medium, and I'm just gonna hit Vivian's few tiny little spots. And then I'm just gonna blend those guys in, and I'm just gonna use my finger. I'm a fingers girl. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of setting powder. The thing is that as we you know, hit 35 and up, we are afraid to use blush, but blush really gives us that youthful glow. So I'm using the Flamingo and Apricot. I'm just gonna take a little bit and mix the two of them together. And then I'm gonna go right for Viv's apples. So here we have the Beauty Counter Duo Eyeshadow in Oyster and Amethyst. So I'm just gonna blend the two of them together. And then I'm gonna cover Vivian's entire lid. And nothing will get your shadow done quicker than covering the entire lid. Now one common thing that you'll find with Asian eyes is that there's a little bit more roundness right here. So it's okay to cover that lid with a darker color. Great, I'm gonna now just go in a little bit with my, my darker purple there, the amethyst, and I'm gonna hit right in here where it tends to be a little bit flatter to create the illusion of depth. So just a touch darker right in here. Subtle. We don't wanna change what's there. We just wanna enhance what's there. And just to add a little bit of lightness right under the brow, I'm gonna be using my lighter peach tone. I'm just gonna blend that in. She already has some nice shaping going on in there. I'm just gonna fill them in a little bit. Now the thing with Asian eyebrows is that they can be very straight. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take my brush and I'm gonna add a little bit of spray to it, just a light mist. And now I can go in there and I can mold them where I want them. So that'll give her kind of a higher arch. Next we're going to add, and we're going for black. So we're going for the black shadow. I have my Beauty Counter Liner Pencil here. I'm gonna dip it in some water and I'm gonna hit it with the black and I'm going to line the top part. Now, I am not a fan of trying to hide what's there. I think I said that already. Vivian has this beautiful steep slope near the center of her eye and I don't wanna take away from that. I wanna absolutely show so that. We're just gonna start out here. I'm lifting that skin up so it's nice and taut and then I'm just moving in towards the center. Now I'm sticking my brush kind of inside and under her lashes. Now, you see how Vivian's looking over for me? So I'm gonna get right inside the eyelid there, almost like up in the waterline. So next I'm just going to add a little bit of uh, liner to the bottom and I'm gonna do that in two steps with the violet. I'm just gonna go right underneath the waterline and kind of into it just a little bit, but I'm actually gonna put black inside there. I'm gonna take my brush and I'm just gonna blend. A lot of Asian girls wanna stay away from lining the inside of their eye. And I'm not sure why that is because it's such a beautiful exotic eye shape that um, I don't see anything wrong with showing it off. So I'm just going right into that waterline and I'm bleeding into that lash line. So next we're just gonna use a eyelash curler and so one little hot tip for very straight Asian eyelashes is to give it a little mist. I always love my strengthening control because it's super light. The problem is that you're gonna have to clean your eyelash curler a little bit more. So you're just gonna do a, a nice little ch -ch. So next we're gonna add our Dior Addict and this one is a particularly wonderful brush because it really pulls those curls and it'll really give it that nice bend. Look straight out. This look is really like an amped up day look that Viv could go into night with. And so we're using Sienna by Beauty Counter. This gloss is super duper luscious. Um, if you had, if you wanted more of an evening kind of heavier look, you might want to put a darker color underneath and then put this on top. But for day makeup, for an amped up day makeup, it's just the perfect little touch. All right, friends. Well, if you like that tutorial and you want to see more like that, come check us out at beauty-snap.com. And you can find us on Facebook at Beauty Snap. We hope to see you soon. Bye.